Greetings, traveler. Come in, come in. I am a non-specific wizard, and this is my lawyer. Uh, hi. I have brought you here to tell you about magical rings from the realm of gentlebands.com. Uh, uh, no. No, they're not magical. But they are unique and hand forged from rare materials such as meteorite, dinosaur bone, skateboards, guitar string, and retired spaceship titanium. And... Don't say it. They're magic. No, they're not magic. You cannot legally make that claim. Take this ring I selected for myself, for example. It is forged from genuine African windwood and clad in a glimmering sheath of brushed gold tungsten with polished bevels that create a look that blends nature's majesty with the luxury of fine metal. I chose this ring because it is traditional in spirit, but it holds much more on closer inspection. And it's magic. The rings are not magic. I, I'm sorry about this. Fine. The ring may not be magic, but the discount code MATTHEWMC is magic, for it gets you 25% off of your order from gentlebands.com. It helps support the channel and gives you something in return. So go to gentlebands.com and you could become a lord of- No, no. <laughs> this is my dorm here. I'll see you at potions class tomorrow. See you in class. Next trip to Hogsmeade, a butter beer's on you. Sure. <laughs> sure, sure. What is seen in the middle of March and April that can't be seen at the beginning or end of either month? What? Huh? What is seen in the middle of March and April that can't be seen at the beginning or end of either month? Oh no, the writ will change tonight. Um, uh, rain? Uh, not quite. What about, like, middle numbers? N not like <coughs> a one or, or like a 30, but maybe a 12, like the date? Still not, I'm afraid. Oh, uh, okay. Look, door, I've been at Hogsmeade all night. I'm a little woozy and tired and I want to go to bed. I can't answer your riddle, so how about I just go to bed, come back out in the morning, and I'll tell you the answer then. I'm afraid not. What is seen well, in the you middle? You know what? You're an awful door. None of the other houses have to enter a stupid riddle to get into their dorms. <laughs> You're a bad Ravenclaw. I've never seen a student take more than one attempt at one of my riddles. Is it bees? Did you say bees? We don't even need a door here. This could be a hallway. I'm glad you like hallways because you will be sleeping in one. Wilson, Cynthia, Frigo, Barda. For your sake, I'm going to pretend you didn't do that. What is seen in the middle of March and April that can't be seen at the beginning or end of either month? Oh, my Ravenclaw for Merlin's sake, I should be able to figure out this stupid riddle. Looks like someone had a little bit too much butterbeer last night. No, I was just testing the door security. By trying to blast the door down? I, I, I couldn't solve the riddle. All right, mate? R. Huh? The answer to the riddle is the letter R for Ravenclaw. If you're going to represent Ravenclaw House, you're going to have to do better. <sighs> i remember that for next time. Thank you. And next time, maybe stick to pumpkin juice. It's sure to be less trouble. Wait, the door, wait! I'm aware of letters three. Add two, and fewer there will be. Again? Uh, uh. Havana can. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like or comment down below and subscribe while you're down there. And I'll see you in the next video.